I had a couple of questions about uh, my moving XOR script that I wrote for the 010 editor. And the reason that I wrote this is because I encountered a malware sample that uh, used that type of uh, encoding. So let me show you uh, how this works in a video. So we do the moving XOR uh, encoding. We can do it from left to right or from right to left. Default is from left to right. And then the offset. So here default is minus one. Okay, and this is here the encoding. So how does this, does this work? Well, let's undo this. And let me show you with another version of the script which does this step by step. This is the version that does it uh, step by step. So again, we go from left to right. So that means that we will XOR this byte and this byte and this byte here from left to right. And also the bytes that we uh, XOR together is defined by the offset. And the offset here by de default is minus one. So here we are going to XOR this byte and this byte and store the result here. And then we will XOR this byte and this byte and store the result here and so on. So first of all, here, let's do this step by step. We have 41 and 42. This will be XOR together and stored here at this position. So let's do this. The result is three. So now next step, three and 43 or XOR together and the result is stored here. So that's four zero. Next step, four zero and four four are XOR together and this is stored here. Like this. This is four. Next step, four and four five are XOR together and the result is stored here. This becomes forty one, four one. Last step, for one and for six are stored together and then stored here. This is zero seven. So this is how this encoding works. We can also decode this by uh, running the same script, but then instead of going from left to right, we go from right to left. So we can type R, it's not uh, case sensitive. And also the offset is minus one. And this is uh, the decoding. So uh, here we have again, A, B, C, D, E, F. So this is uh, how the script works. It can also work on a selection like here. We have a XML, this is a message. And you can run the script. Moving XOR selection. And now Let's just go from right to left, just to have a, a different encoding. Say that the offset is one, and then here you have uh, the decoded, the encoded message, which you can decode by running this again. Now from left to right, offset one, and we have uh, the original again. <coughs> 